Hey, what's up, YouTube? Binks here with another quick video. Um, sorry, I haven't been posting very much recently. It's not that I haven't been buying or doing much stuff with Pokemon. I just haven't had the time. I've also been kind of sick. If you can kind of hear my voice, but uh, a couple things. You can tell I got a new uh, background there. Painted, painted my kitchen a different color, so it might look better. I don't know. Um, but without further ado, here we go. I have a stack of packages and envelopes, I guess, of cards that I've been buying. They've been piling up. So let's get going through them. First one, oh, it's not showing up by my address. This is a Troll and Toad purchase. Always a reputable Pokemon card seller. And this is just kind of a spontaneous buy. I love this art for this Flareon. This is from Pokemon Generations. <clears throat> Excuse me. And of course it shows a Porygon and Jolteon as well in the background. Just an awesome looking artwork. It's one of my favorites. Let me set him in the back there. Okay, moving on. Just an envelope here. bit of mystery here. What's it gonna be? It is a Team Rocket Unlimited Non-Hollow Charizard. This is just something I didn't have in my Rocket set, so I bought it so I can knock out one of those uh, empty spots in my set for that binder. Okay. Next card here. Might be two cards. Some of these are two cards. Okay, this is from... Char the Charizard Authority, Authority, PCA Gaming. He is a staple in the Pokemon community. Looks like he's actually doing some uh, PSA submissions for people. So yeah, if you see happen to see the video and want to do PSA, go ahead and contact Rusty at TCA. He's an awesome seller. I'm sure he's a very uh, trustworthy guy to get your uh, cards submitted to PSA. So these are some uh, just some non-hollow rares from Neo Destiny that I need to get filled out. So we got a light pillow swine and a dark ursaring. I'll take those out, put them in individual sleeves and binders later, later on. Next card here. We got a couple. So a lot of these are just cheapies, but some of these are one of these is pretty pricey card. So we got this. It might be this one. And it is. This is the Lucky Stadium Black Star promo number 41 from the original Wars of the Coast Black Star promo set. And this is actually the final card that I needed for that set. So with this, I had the entire promo set completed. So that is a an awesome goal to have finished. Set that in the middle there. That's actually a pretty pricey card. I think I got for. I made him an offer for 115 I think he, he accepted that, so it was kind of cool. Um, I've seen him go for a, for a higher. They've been going up in value lately, so. And it's, what an awesome card. It's got Charizard, Pikachu, and Pichu on it. So it's kind of a rare, off the cuff uh, artwork. And um, it was only released in New York at the Pokemon Center. So that's a cool effect there too. And here we got a hold back Japanese card. And it is a vending series Machoke. I don't know why I bought this. I just think the art is just badass. Look at that artwork. Machoke is just going crazy. Throwing a haymaker punches. He's cool. Okay, moving on. We have two more Neo. Destiny Hollow or non hollow rares, a dark Omastar, and this is a oh, sorry, a um, new discovery hollow unknown. A <clears throat> trying to fill out some of these sets that I have made holes in. So, next card here. Oh, there's two cards in here. Dark Mag Cargo from Neo Destiny, another non holo and Dark Area Dose. Neo Destiny, non holo Like I said, these are just to fill out 
fill out these sets. This is someone, a local friend of mine, just gave me these. I posted on one of the Facebook groups that we're both a part of, and he, he's like, hey, I have those. And uh, his daughter actually babysits my kids, so he gave them to her. So he's an adult collector like myself. And, uh, these are just some uncommon and common Neo Destiny cards that I need for my set. So he gave them to me. He had them as extras, and it's really cool of him to do. Next card. I don't even remember some of these cards that I bought. Oh, okay. We have a Hollow Dark Doug Trio from Team Rocket. Very cool. Very cool. Ooh, got a nice little spiral up there. You can catch that. Looks pretty, pretty good. I'm going to have to get out and check it, but edges look pretty good in the top loader. I'll inspect that a little closer later. But yeah, this is just going to be uh, put into the binder. Put you over there. Choke. Right, three packages left. I think the most exciting thing is probably that Lucky Stadium, as far as expensive slash rare. This guy, okay. non hollow Dragonite. Look at this. This artwork is so amazing. And this is not on the card. It's just tape residue from the guy that he taped over the the card. Look at that, the rainbow background. I almost like this version better than the non-hollow, than the, the hollow version. Look at Dragonite, just chilling. Beautiful card. Yeah, I know the hollows aren't as exciting, but the, the non-hollows aren't as exciting, excuse me. But, you gotta have them for your sets, you know. For the master set collectors, you gotta have one of every one. I think this is actually the last fossil card I needed. For some, I had one and I sold it for some reason. And I, I just bought one back because, you know, whatever. We have a non hollow Dark Weezy. Another not very exciting card. No one really likes the Dark Weezy. And I'm not going to lie, I don't really like it either. But like I just said, got done saying with the Dragonite, you need it in your set. So you gotta go down there. It's like a dollar card. <laughs> And the final package for this epic mail opening extravaganza is our two cars, yet again from Rusty at TCA Gaming. Now I already have these promos from the original Black Star set, but not this variant. So if you know this Rapidash and this Ho-Oh, these are from the Pokemon Center in New York. And they had this little stamp. The two that I have were from a magazine. I'm not sure which magazine. I remember, I remember getting it as a kid and pulling them out. And hey, I've got those cards. But these have the stamp on them. I didn't have this variant. So I'm going to make some spots in my binder. And these are going to go in there with just right next to the others. Because there's officially like two, two styles of this. Blackstar promo, so that's kind of cool. And of course, it came from Rusty, and they're tripped well, perfect condition. I think he did put them in the same sleeve, but he's knowledgeable enough with cards to not put them in there and slide them together. He probably put them in there very gently, and I'm not concerned about them being damaged by being shipped in the same sleeve. So. Totally cool. I'll take them out. And Put them in their own sleeves later. So. And I love ordering cards because you get all, you get a bunch of these. You get a bunch of these, and I like putting my like, some special like really rare cards with that in top loaders. I like putting these back over. Um, and I just never buy these for some reason, so I just read what people send me. So again, if you uh, want to send some stuff to PSA, maybe consider uh, Rusty from TCA. He's awesome dude i like watching his videos on youtube his i think his name's charizard authority but uh yeah if you guys have, uh like this video maybe consider uh leaving a like and maybe even subscribing i try to post videos as much as i can um i'm buying stuff all the time so if you like my content feel free to do that and uh, until next time guys take it easy Bye bye